Hello, my name's Stephen Tall. I'm one of the uh, editors of Liberal Democrat Voice website, the number one independent website for Liberal Democrat supporters. And you may remember a couple of weeks ago I posted a video message promoting our annual Liberal Voice of the Year awards. And this is an award that we make to the individual, group or organisation that our readers of Liberal Democrat Voice believe has contributed most to society in promoting liberal values over the past 12 months. Well, we've been inviting nominations and uh, we've now produced our shortlist of eight and uh, these are the people who we have uh, shortlisted. First up is Guy Herbert, General Secretary of No to ID, for his and his organisation's campaigning work against the database state. And then we have Peter Tatchell, fearless uh, human rights campaigner internationally. Then we have Joanna Lumley, who has done so much in the past year to promote the rights of veteran Gurkhas. We have Rory Stewart for his straight-talking common sense on the conflict in Afghanistan. Terry Pratchett in recognition of his uh, promotion of uh, liberal philosophy through his works of fiction. Henry Porter, journalist and co-founder of the Convention on Modern Liberty for his campaigning work on behalf of uh, civil rights. Ben Goldacre, author of Bad Science for his satirical criticism of scientific inaccuracy. And finally, Alan Rusbridger, editor of The Guardian and Twitter, for defeating Trafigura's super injunction. And if you visit the Liberal Democrat Voice website now, you will find that a poll is live, look to the right-hand column of the site, and cast your vote for the person that you think of that list most merits the, the award for Liberal Voice of the Year, and we'll be announcing the results in the next few days. Uh, do please have a look at the rest of the site as well, loads of new articles cur currently up there, and uh, we hope to see you over there. Thanks very much. Bye.